Good afternoon. I understand. Three years ago, my grandfather got diagnosed with cancer. For years, we struggled to find him, qualified home nurses to take care of him at home in South. Sometimes we even had to get him all the way from South to Beirut in order to get him the treatment he deserves. Great home nurses should be empathetic, polite, and professional. In our case, unfortunately, sometimes, the nurses were not. We wished we could tell ahead of time if the nurse is going to be professional or not, but we couldn't. We cannot do a full recruitment, HR, on your neighbor nurse before recruiting them. This is why I wanted to build my nurse, an online platform, a mobile application, where you have the chance to go and look and book qualified nearby nurses. At the same time, we're creating job opportunities for nurses between the working shifts. It's as easy as going to the mobile application. So for example, I need a female nurse for my mom to move at 10 a.m. approximately. Then, I will be specifying the exact location and address and telling the type of medical care I need. Now we're looking for matching nurses. I got these three matches that are relevant to my search filters. I will pick based on rating, description of experience, and of course, the average hourly rate. I will choose this nurse because of her experience in such a removal and surgical operations. Now, we come into more information about the patient and the billing address information. Once I confirm, I get a message. Not only this, I can also follow up on the patient while she's doing her job. I don't want to worry about my mom, whether she had a good day or not. I want to know when the nurse arrives. I want to know when my mom takes the medication and whether she feels good or not after the medication. And I want a feature that lets me rate the nurse and get feedback for other users to know whether this nurse is good or not. And of course for us, because we will be making her or him if the service of quality of service was not good. Our end users are elderly who need home nursing care. And our perfect customers are their children who need to look for and book nurses without having much time to do this. And we make money through revenue sharing with nurses. And our team is a couple of enthusiastic mobile developers and engineers, Jad and Hadi, and me. My, our the medical advisor is Dr. Duman, the president of Order of Nurses. And I've also had some experience in traditional home nursing work, where I did this project in South Lebanon. I put a couple of posters, seven, eight posters in, on pharmacies. I expected to get only calls from patients, but I also got calls from nurses asking to work with us. So I've had some five to six months experience with this which makes us qualified to do this kind of job. Our next step is trying to raise $15,000 capital to cover us for the next six months. And during this period, we'll be asking for more money from investors. And we're open to your questions if you have any. The nurse will be sending notifications through the system whether the patient is okay, whether he or she takes so the medication. Definitely. The nurses are not just any nurses who signed up to be on our platform. They are well recruited. The, any nurse cannot go and join the platform unless we recruit him or her and we make sure everything is right about the qualification and the experience. How do you rate the nurses if there's a bedridden patient who cannot rate the nurse? Or this is not mostly for patients, this is for the families. So the end user is the patient, but we don't really target these people. We target their children who don't have time to find nurses. You might send a nurse to a patient with no family members. Yeah, and in this case, either this will have to go without rating, or if the patient knows how to monitor, they will do it. If not, it will go without rating.
So what exactly did you do with the, with the past 48 hours? I didn't hear your question. The last two days, what did you do? I mean, we, built, so we built this app. Right. We built this app uh, that uh, describes all the necessary functions that we need in order to start for the next six, six months. So you built the app? Yes, we just demonstrated. Do you support Arabic and French? So we haven't thought of this because we think that uh, our customers, our most important customers, are well educated, and these are the working people, middle-aged uh, people working. So uh, we thought of English, but yeah, this is a good feature to be added later on. Actually, the localization takes time, so uh, for us to develop this and implement this, uh, we'll be doing this through the next phase of development and not for within the scope of this project. Okay, thank you, Tim.